Okay, today's agenda is all about family. How they treat you, how they act around you, and how they are in general. Well, some family, to me, some families are fine, some families might need improvement, some families should have never been put together. Mm. Sorry about that. Mm. And... Uh, right now, I'm feeling like my family should not have been put together. I mean, what does the hell does it say about me that I was created a borderline mentally retarded person? to fit in this family. What does that say? I mean... If we were all meant to where we were supposed to be... Um... I don't think any of us... There would be any cat people. Except for the ones that were in car accidents or or handicapped dude or something a doctor did. Other than that, or a birth defect that couldn't be helped, which is pretty much why there are handicapped. But, let me scratch that. There wouldn't be any people with birth defects if we all were meant to, if we were where we needed to be, I think. Because... I've never felt like, I've never felt like I've belonged here. Granted, I've been shown that I do, but I still don't feel like I belong here. I mean, I think I think you should be able to follow your own path, not follow the path someone else wants you to take. I think that if we are all supposed to have equal rights, of uh, the treatment of others should be differently. I just don't understand why no one treats anyone the way they want to be treated. Would you, tr if you knew someone was, I mean, what's, I mean, why spoil and treat a damn handicapped person like a damn baby so they can stay a baby? What's the point of that? If you want them to be an adult, which, if you want them to be a physical adult, treat them like a physical adult. I mean, 
you're hindering their growing up by treating them like a child. And then they haven't learned. Now I know I, I, I mean some of them have, I know that some of them can't help it or but some of them can because they weren't but those that weren't brainwashed into thinking oh you can't do this you can't do that oh I gotta do a thing for you I gotta spoil you nowhere and over there. And I mean, I what was that? Uh, uh, what's that one di that always fights for handicapped people's rights? I can't remember the name. It's a law firm. Oh, I know it starts with it starts with the B. Anyways, and here in Arkansas. Anyway, I think it's Bender and Bender. I think that's right. Anyway, <laughs> uh, there, that, I mean, that's great. They're fighting for equal rights and all that, but true. If, but if a person truly is to feel like they belong and not have these feelings of depression and unlovingness and uh, just feeling like no one gives a damn which is what I feel on a daily freaking basis uh, and this was way way before my breakup with Brandon uh, I mean I, I don't know it's my family environment My question is, what the freak am I doing? Am I doing anybody any good being here? When uh, I'm told I'm no good, I don't do anything right, and I have n never, ever, ever, ever had seem to felt the respect of my father but recently I've just now felt the respect from my mother I mean and I don't I don't think you're supposed to just lie down and take people's shit I mean that's not right you don't l just lie down and take it. I don't care who the freak you are. You don't lie down and take people's shit. You stand up for yourself. You be your own person. You don't just let everyone walk all over you and make you feel like shit. I don't care if you're handicapped, in a bad marriage, uh, a child being abused. You stand up for yourself. Always stand up for yourself. If you don't stand up for yourself, uh, 
then you won't and then I don't think anybody's gonna stand up for you if you don't stand up for yourself I mean there are plenty of people that will if even if you don't but because uh, uh, maybe out of guilt maybe because they feel bad for you and they feel they need to do something but if you don't stand up for yourself no one's gonna stand up for you <clears throat> and I think that it is absolutely insane that they have all these pro they have all these programs for people like me, people that are being abused, yet no one's willing to um let there's very no one or very few people are w willing to help these places out and so they I mean my mother thinks oh they get all they get that all these places get, that Orango gets a lot of money from all of us being there. Um, if that was true, I don't think most of them would need second freaking jobs. So they need help. And I don't feel they're getting it. I mean, I love the place. I'm going out of the Donnie Martin Center. I love the fact that I get to hang out with friends or whatever. And learn stuff that I really wasn't taught in school because they just passed me on instead of actually teaching me. I mean, the world has just give up. Your child's a maniac, and your teachers can't handle them? Get them drugs! Oh, that'll help. Just kill them several years down the road after they've took them the damn shit. Damn crap forever. Uh, your child oh, is being able to have a job, put them on disability. Your uh, <coughs> now, now, now that I mean the uh, normal children. The, I'm talking about the people that are called slackers and druggies. I'm not talking about people like me. And I mean, of course, Okay, I'm 
don't even know what the heck. I'm a sure I can say, but oh, yeah. Um, I was talking about the pe. I was gonna start talking about the people that are handicapped, like me. Uh, anyway, <laughs> before this the hell thing stopped at 15 minutes. Uh, I was kind of ranting on handicapped people getting married. I was kind of confused. Oh, I'm kind of co confused on uh, why they have to have their checks. I mean, I think I kind of got it, but I'm not sure. Um, of course, I've never really known a normal person having to have things. Well, not anybody, well, not anybody in my immediate family. Uh, my parents don't have a joint account. So... I really don't understand that. Uh, anyway, this, the, all this crap's been on my mind for years. That It seems like because I feel like I'm getting the short end of the stick, I can see other. I can see when others are getting the short end of the stick, and it's just kind of pissing me off that you hear about equal rights and all this shit stuff. Excuse my language. Anyways, you hear about it rights and all this stuff and uh, um, I just where are their equal rights? Where are they? I mean there's I don't see any equal rights I see this, the whole world is acting like a bunch of whiny ass kids in a daycare center. I mean, I know the world's not perfect, but jeez. I mean, the least y'all could do we all could do is help each other out and be uh pretty much and give each other a positive attitude all I've seen is negative 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 and it get and and if I see any positive, I can't enjoy it because um, at that moment, I feel like I'm drowning in negativity. <sighs> or blinded by negativity because of my surroundings. And I just wish people would freaking wake up and start treating each other with respect and love and treat each other 
like they would want to be treated. I mean, and we are a human race. Well, I'm trying to, at least, I was going to say, I can't, I really don't see color, but I'm, I do see color, and I'm trying, I know I kind of call, I could do the racist bull malarkey and stuff, but we're a human race. There should not be... I mean, you don't, s let's just say, okay, take care of the movie Madagascar, there was, I mean, I know that would not forever happen in real animal world, but look, a, a hippo marrying a giraffe, or anything like that, but, and I, but, we all need, what I'm saying here is, uh, they strive for free quality, or, or showed us what it is, what equality is, I haven't seen equality, I haven't seen equal, I haven't seen anything equal. I've seen, oh, I'm better than you, I'm better than you, I'm better than you. I've never seen, I haven't seen anything. And, I have seen, you can't handle shit, take drugs. You can't handle your kid the way they are, give them drugs. You, uh, you think the world's against you? Take drugs. Drugs, 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 drugs. I mean, drugs ain't the answer. Uh, alcohol ain't the answer. And, I don't think it takes someone like me, or someone slower, to get, have America realize what they need is God. I mean, granted, I haven't opened a Bible in a while, and... So, I'm right talking. People are probably think I'm talking that way. But, here's my drift. But, uh, I do know we, we need God. And, I would just like to take this moment to apologize to the person that I practically ch ooh, whose throat I practically chew ooh, uh, whose head I practically chewed off yesterday for leaving me a religious comment in my mind. I have God. He's here with me. I may not like it, but I have him. Uh, but I don't think you should, and I really don't think you ram God down people's throats. You agree with what I'm saying? Like the video. If you don't agree with what I'm saying, just like the video. I, it doesn't know. I don't care either way. We all need to be able to express our own opinions. 
and yet treat each other equally and with respect. Respect what I'm saying, but don't but don't get all up in arms if I'm not saying something you like. Anyways, uh, see you around if you're not square, y'all. I'm out.